All right, so what I'm going to highlight here is a countdown timer, very simple, effective tool for using it inside the classroom. Normally, I project this up on the screen. It's just online-stopwatch.com, and it's going to give you a ton of features here. So you're going to have a, you know, counting up stopwatch, counting down. I, I tend to use the countdown timer. Again, super simple. You just set your time, click set, click start, and you are good to go. Um, if you just go to, so if you take this off or you click to online stopwatch, um, you can see a bunch of other features that it has. You know, so here they have, you know, the large stopwatch. They have a smaller version here. You know, a couple other like egg timers and, and things like that. Definitely custom countdown is, is pretty cool with uh, custom sounds, uh, dates. You can kind of make your own timer here. Uh, but I, I just find that this is super useful inside of the classroom. All right, so in addition to that, I like making my own timer right here. This one allows you to customize a date and a time. So if there's a report, you know, you can add in, you know, a couple little template backgrounds and things like that. The little hourglassing is fine. Uh, but you can enter a name of an event. So I can put report due. And then I'm just going to give it a date. So, you know, I'm going to say, okay, well, it's due uh, May 14th. And then you're going to go ahead and put in 2019. Like that. And so right here, it gives you, you know, a, a countdown of, of how long it has. And you can just click get my timer and it's going to create a custom URL for you right here. Um, this you can post or save somewhere and it's just great to give a visual like how much, you know, how many days, hours are left on there. So just, just a, you know, kind of a, a cool way to see, you know, what's going to happen in the future and how many days or hours are left until your item is due.